Hey guys, it's you two here, and here I am. I'm with another requested video. And this is Dot of Discord, episode 3, called A Peculiar Playdate. Now, okay, so let me tell you a little story before this goes on. Um, I have still yet to render the past two weeks of MLP. I'm getting there, I just, uh, I don't have the time for it to render. I mean, it takes forever sometimes. It takes, you know, a, a full day sometimes. It's, I don't know. I'm not trying to make excuses, really. But I'm behind, and it sucks to be behind. It always sucks to be behind. Because now I have tons of videos I would like to, rec well, that I'm recording my reactions to. I just gotta post it for you guys. So, I'll hopefully get the chance to do everything soon. I'm gonna try my best to post everything relatively soon, so then I can be up to date on everything. But this is another one I, uh, I particularly wanted to do, because it's one of the series I've started, and I'd just like to continue on with it. Um, so, yeah, I really need to find some more free time. It's It's been really tough. It's, it's been tiring, you know, getting home from work and whatnot. Anyways, in other news, I have watched Steven Universe. I've caught up, and I'm going to actually start recording reactions to that series. So, uh, the first two episodes of the special event in Too Deep should be coming whenever I can find downloads for those episodes. I've never really tried downloading Steven Universe before, so if you guys can recommend a site for me to do that, you know, or know of a, uh, a site that posts, like, relatively soon after the episodes come out, please let me know. I'd be interested, because I'd love to get some Steven Universe reactions out to you guys. I'm honestly sorry that I haven't reacted to, uh, you know, the beginning of the series until then, but uh, it just so happened that I wanted to do that on my free time, and I didn't honestly think about it. But I've decided uh, that I would do it for here on out, live. Anyways, uh, so whenever I get downloads for that, I'll probably post them. So. Today is Thursday, the day that those episodes premiered, and, uh, yeah. I'll probably post them Friday or Saturday, or at least record my reactions to them. So anyways, here we go. Daughter of Discord, episode 3, Peculiar Playdate. I'm assuming Screwball and Mothball are going to meet again, and so yeah. Let's just get on with it, shall we? I'm gonna start in three, two, one, go. Previously, and here we go. Previously, my name's Screwball. My name's Hi, Screwball. Mothball. I'm Mothball. My daughter. And yeah, Discord's getting crazy at Chrysalis. I was only fetching my son. He is the heir to my throne. Yep. You know her? Our paths have crossed a few times. For centuries, we have competed for Equestria's throne. <laughs> I've been searching for his weakness. Until I assumed that creature to be as heartless as us. But now he has something he cares about. I want you to find This is a long video, isn't it? Isn't this. it like 40 minutes? Remember even crazy? She's I don't just, know. Just so nice. Do as I say. Yes, mother. Yes, mother. Disney fanatic two three six four. Da 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 da. Da, da, da. Oh, whoops. <laughs> My Little Pony Audio Drama. And here we go. Katie Patterson. The Williamson Eater. Velvet Sugar. Ultra and Roll. Choose Later Comet. And okay. Indeed. San Joseph. Daughter of Discord.
Okay. Now who can tell me what seven minus five is? So no school. Fair. I can't count yet. Shut up, Prism. I'll wow. tell mommy and daddy you said a bad word. <laughs> Silence in my class. Uh, why are we doing this again, Big Brother? To see if her special talent is teaching. I don't even know. Like Aunt Charlie. What are y'all oh. whispering about? There'll be no talking in my class unless I call on you. She kind of seems to be abusing her power. Apple One more word out of you, Cinnamon Roll, and you'll be sitting in the <laughs> court. Cinnamon sorry, Roll. cuz. That's sorry, Miss Blossom, to you. So she has to be teacher. Are you paying attention? Oh, sorry, guys. Nope. <laughs> I'm distracted today. What's up? Really? Yeah, we thought you'd be happy now that you're not grounded anymore. You don't look so good, Scooby. Hmm. Did you eat some bad muffins for breakfast? <laughs> no. I just have a I love Dinky's voice. Well, get those things out of your mind. We got a lesson here. Cut the theatrics, Blossom. Can't you see Screwball's having a crisis here? Hmm. I think you're a great. I teacher. really like <laughs> uh, the <laughs> visuals so sweet, with this. <sighs> you smell nice. What was that? Uh, uh, nothing. Maybe she has low blood sugar. I made some rolls this morning. They have lots of sugar. We gave one to Dad, and his feet would just not stop moving. <laughs> just ask Cinnamon Stick. Don't be silly. Interesting. Sure, it's nothing but cotton candy and chocolate. She's never low on blood sugar. <laughs> yeah. Is she sick? No, that's even sillier. Screwball's the princess of chaos. She never gets sick. Why would she yeah. get sick? Don't yeah. Be an idiot, Prism. You said yeah. another bad word. <laughs> I'm telling. Idiot is not a bad word. Neither is shut up. Yeah, a bad word would be. I mean, it's a really little kid. It like kind of is. Sweet I don't know. Sweet Celestia. Just tell us what's wrong, <laughs> Screwy, so we can stop arguing about it. Do you guys know what a changeling is? <gasps> what's a changeling? They're sheep. Interesting. They don't know. They're scary. And they some do. The some don't. The ones you love. And they the little ones. Love. Like don't. Spaghetti. Our mom battled those guys at Flutter by like Lily's parents' wedding. They were tough. But our mom was victorious. Ahem. Our parents were there too. So was Screwball's mom, Aunt Twilight, Aunt Rarity, yep. and Nambiki. But mom said Prince Shining Armor and Princess Cadence defeated them in the end. Well, yeah, but mom fought them off hard with a rainbow rocket punch. Yeah, our mommy's awesome. Shut up, Prism. Potty mouth. Why'd you ask, Screwy? Yeah, she's just that mean to her... I mean, she's just mean to her sister. Hey, did I hear something about cinnamon rolls? Yeah, okay, clearly. Oh, this is interesting. Brilliant switch fly transformation, Oh, interesting. You're improving. That's all for today. You may go to bed now. But you just woke me from my nap. And now wow. you can return to it. The future king needs his rest. <sighs> yes, mother. <laughs> How come a miserable little brat like him gets to be the prince? I've served this hive longer than he has. So, we yeah, of course. Hatchling. People of the special. hive are jealous. He's just a tall like, kid with a fancy mane and pupils. Talk about discrimination. It's Jealousy... Absurd. I mean, he's Jealousy just runs and stuff like that, really. And he's not even that good at it. The least her majesty could do is pick a female to the air. It is. After all, a male Twelve thirty-eight p.m. On the bright side, or a.m. Excuse me. A queen when he inherits the throne. Pretty late. Maybe he'll pick me. Ha! As if you would stand a chance. Hm. Your chances don't seem any better. Even though I don't like him, he'd pick me above you. It doesn't matter. We've never needed a king, and we don't need one now. Dang. How come he gets his own room? They're right. As I they said, discrimination is just... It's horrible. I'm nothing special. I'm not clever and ambitious like Mother. I just look different. I can't even have babies. <sighs> yeah, because you're a male. Mother did say I could choose a queen when I'm older, but I don't know any girls. That filly was kind of cute, though. Ah, her swirly hair. And yeah, he's gonna like dream about her. 
basically. What is wrong with me? She's just a stupid girl. <laughs> a stupid <sighs> girl. <laughs> oh, who am I kidding? I can't stop thinking about her. I have yeah. to see her again. That happens with crushes. If I turn into a fruit fly, no one will see me. But you could get swatted. I don't know. And lived happily ever after. The end. The end. Wow. <laughs> I can see why my friends were so shaky when I brought up changelings. I hope I didn't scare you. No. But mom, do you really believe all changelings are heartless? I'm sure your father was just exaggerating. Of course. Yeah. Oh, after that incident in Canterlot, I almost believe him. Then again, I thought your father was a heartless monster before I got to know him. Hypocrite. He just worries <laughs> for you, honey. After all, you are a special little girl. Now, I think that's enough storytelling for tonight. Time for you to sleep. <gasps> Aww. Oh, good night, Mommy. Good night, my angel. I love you. Love you, too. That's cute. Lights out. Oh, the instrumental is is playing. Interesting. Not not. Huh? What happened? Who's oh, there? the window. Oh, hey. What are you doing here? I wanted to see you again. <laughs> to have more and this has reminded me a little bit of uh, Romeo and Juliet. Are you crazy? What if my parents see you? Just like with the window scene or whatever. So you're coming or what? Or maybe like Rapunzel? I don't know. I can trust you. If I wanted I'm just to thinking of like time, movies of like window scenes, you know. Uh, okay, but only because I think you're weird. Um, yeah, only. Thanks. I love that art style. Nice way. That's that's great. Oh. Meet me at the Chocolate Lake in 15 minutes. If I'm not there by 15 minutes, send a vanilla cream pie after me. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, that'll <laughs> that'll do the trick. <laughs> I'm glad you came. Don't get happy just yet. I want to know what all of this is about. <sighs> I take it your parents told you a lot about changelings, huh? Well, my mother told me a lot about your parents. What about them? Well, for starters, she told me that your dad was Lord of Chaos who took over Equestria two or three times. He's not like that anymore. Not yeah, he's that changed. Mom. Yeah, she said that too. How did that happen, anyway? My parents, you mean? It's a long yeah. story. Don't take this the wrong way. Just, uh... How did a pony fall Just see Bride of Discord. <laughs> the of chaos? It's a funny story, really. See, the last time Daddy took over Equestria, he asked for a bride for marriage yet, so they didn't tie the knot until a year later. Try to Discord. And they had me. <laughs> that, that's the most romantic thing I've ever heard. Yeah, you know, it's probably the only romantic thing you've heard. At first, but he's a real softy once you get to know him. <laughs> I think he'd prefer not to know me. So what's your dad like? Oh. I don't have a dad. I don't exactly <laughs> have a father. Yeah, how did I oh, know? You never knew him? Sorry, I didn't know. No, no, it's not like that. The changeling race kind of works like a beehive. You know that every hive has a queen, right? Sure. Well, that's my mom. She gives birth to all the changelings. That's what I meant when I said I have 5,000 brothers and sisters. Wow. I always wondered what it was like not to be an only child. <laughs> what I wouldn't give to be an only child. Just because I have a lot of siblings doesn't mean we're one big happy family. Oh no, with that many you can't be. Most of them hate me. Yeah. I don't know if you've noticed, but I'm a bit different from most changelings. Because you're a prince? Well, yeah. What I mean is, changelings don't usually look the way I do. They don't have hair or pupils, for example. They're more bug-like than pony-like. 
When my mother saw that I was special, she went and made me heir to her throne. You're special? What a clicky dink! I'm special too! Oh, yeah. Oh, I didn't mean to brag. It's just a fact. <laughs> I figured. I've never <laughs> met a half pony, half, uh. uh George Quaniquist. Yes. Half Draconica. <laughs> Draconiquai. Draconumbrous. <laughs> Tracking numbers. <laughs> Good try. Yeah, anyway, your magic is really amazing. I've never seen anything like it. Please, you should see my dad's. He can turn an entire orchard into an ice skating rink. <laughs> so, I bet if you looked up the word special in the dictionary, there would be a picture of you. I'm Aww. sure you'd be there too. <sighs> the only thing that makes me special is that I look different. So? There's nothing wrong with being different. If that weren't the only reason I was prince! <gasps> mm hmm. Anger Sorry. issues, a anger Just like built up. Me how every you know, envy that happens. Being the queen's favorite, a position I neither deserve nor want. Self loving is, don't want it, is hard don't sometimes. Touch. What you are doesn't label who you are. You're touching my hoof. I'm the daughter of Chaos, but that doesn't mean I'm going to take over Equestria someday. I'm also the daughter of the Element of Kindness, but that doesn't mean I'm Miss Nice to Every Pony. Though, I guess nope. I'm a little bit of both. Yep. But I'm also me. Why are you so nice to me? Even now, when you know what I am. My parents because you can no sympathize, writing, sympathize with you. Every creature has a heart. Yeah. Not changelings. So. So. It's true that you. I said it at the same exact time. Why do you think we feed off love? With nothing to keep our blood pumping, we need the love to survive. But we're incapable of feeling any of that love ourselves. I don't believe that. Stop touching me! What is it you want from me? I want to be your friend. Friend? friend? Fred? Well, what is that? Yeah. If that's okay with you, of course. Um. Well, I. Uh, <laughs> uh, I don't know. I've never had one of those before. <laughs> whoa, whoa! Aww. What, what are you doing? It's called a hug, silly. Do do um, do. Uh. You, uh, want ah, I can't, <laughs> I can't talk. Sure. Get in for! Swimming in chocolate milk. I don't know if I'd like that. Come on in! The milk is like, great! It might be a little too thick you know? for my taste. I don't know. Wanna play Aquafresh with us? <laughs> oh, uh, Aquafresh. Sure. Great. You can put the ball on the bench there. <gasps> on second thought. I like all these like hard effects I think and I stuff. Think I left something on the stove. Uh, Bye. Wait, Aqua. They're doing a lot of it in this episode. I don't mind it. Seriously, is it my breath? Here, let me smell. <sighs> wow. Uh, yep. That's definitely it. Why, Ayana? That's it. It's on, bro. Oh snap, she got her cutie mark! Awesome. Oh, it's a flower! Is your talent gardening? No. Is your talent decorating? With flowers? No. Is your <laughs> talent gardening? We already said that, Rosio. Wow. Again? Nope. My talent is perfumes. Perfumes? Huh? Actually, huh. I have fun to dash to thank for my cutie mark. M me When you told hey. me the other day that I smell nice, I got an idea. You, uh, heard that? Yup, and I'm glad I did. See, that morning, one of Aunt Applejack's pies had fallen on my head, and that's why I had that smell. I figured I could use that smell to make perfume. Here's a sample. <coughs> hey, what's the big idea? Are you trying to poison me, Apple Blossom? <laughs> Sorry about that. Huh, smells good. So, 
Why is it cute so like a flower and not a perfume bottle? Because I have made the perfume out of apple blossoms I have pressed in my scrapbook. Ma says my cutie mark means I can share my apple I got really just every pony. stiff in that one position that whole time, so I had to shoot the positions. You really need to almost kill me over that, but... Stop <laughs> all! Huh? What? Weren't you listening to my story? Oh, sorry, Blossom. Congratulations on your cutie mark. Goodness gracious. What are you even doing to find in a that good there angle. dirt? Doodling in the what now? Doodling in the what now? Since when did you become so girly? What do you mean? <laughs> girly. Uh, screwy. You've covered the ground in lovey dovey hearts. Hello? <gasps> I I hadn't even realized it was S B plus M B? Ooh. Who's M B? No pony. No way. <laughs> oh, Nobody. No, I don't. You so do. You're blushing like crazy. <gasps> yeah? Oh my gosh, who is that? Is he cute? What color is his name? Does he like apples? Does he like muffins? Not fun to dash, is he? Is it cinnamon stick? <laughs> you girls know we're standing right here. <laughs> yeah. Right? So spill. Who is it? Oh, there's the bell. Sorry, guys. Don't Time to go. <laughs> Lots of things to learn in school. Woohoo! I'll squeeze it out of her yet. Just like an apple during cider season. Ah, uh, yeah. Which, right. Maybe we're just being silly. I mean, if Scoobal had a crush, she'd tell us, right? She wouldn't no. keep secrets from us. Because it's a crush. I'm at an odd boy. He's not huh? like any <laughs> other. He's a charm and a joy. And a right song? Now, Interesting. Swirling on my tippy hoos and making up songs. It's so chaotic I can squeal from the way he makes me feel so lovely and flattery. Not bad. Weird and really isn't bad. Happy for how now disappeared. <laughs> Mothball, you're not concentrating. What are you smiling about? Uh, nothing, Mother. I was just thinking. Thinking? Huh? How many times have I told you that thinking is... My queen. The <laughs> thinking is bad. Don't right. think. Just do. Go to your you know. son and work on that lion transformation. What was he going to sing to? I've met an odd girl who's unlike any yep. other. She is out of this world. And right now I discover that I'm dreaming all day Looking through space Smiling like a doofus when I think of her face It's so strange I cannot rest With this thumping in my chest So Not bad. pleasantly and heavenly Driving me nuts But it's also <laughs> warm and nice me nuts. So why should I fuss? I met someone on Who's left you so, so odd, so bubbly and fluttery, and just plain weird, and you don't say hi before. Have now just Sorry, I'm just kind of listening. Yeah, the lyrics work. Not bad. <laughs> She's humming it. Um, honey, is it just me, or has Screwy been acting weirder than usual? You've noticed it too? I mean, twirling in the air, singing to herself, flowers? No doubt about it, there is definitely something wrong with her. Not wrong, just peculiar. She's been staring off in the space a lot, not listening to a word I say. Oh, honey, she does that all the time. What? <laughs> Dang. Miss <laughs> Charlie told me well. I went to go pick Screwball up from school yesterday that she hasn't been paying much attention in class. So, stuff is on her mind. She's thinking that. about stuff a lot. <laughs> oh, okay. Wow. Something more serious than that. <laughs> We're probably worried about nothing. I think Screwy's also the one who's been stealing my perfume. Oh, we'll be glad it's yours and not some pony else's. <laughs> Well, I'd hate to pay another fine. <laughs> what is she talking about? 
Discord. Perfume? I definitely smelled it on her just now. But since when does Screwy wear perfume? Hmm. <laughs> How do I think about it? She has been acting girly lately. Weird. I mean, we went bowling <laughs> yesterday, and when she knocked down all the pins, they jumped back up and stood in the shape of a heart. And when she jumped in the pool, her splash was Interesting. Harsh. She's also been making <laughs> what? with her food. What is going on with her? What happened to my non-kissy, non-mushy little girl? <laughs> Isn't it obvious? <laughs> What's obvious? Honey, we believe our daughter's experiencing She has a crush. Crush? crush. Yep. Yeah. Then... That means... There's a... Boy? <laughs> is a boy involved? What? what? I'll burn him to a crisp if he thinks he can <laughs> take my daughter! He thinks he can match against well. Discord! He has another thing! <laughs> Will you get a hold of yourself? Where did you get that bucket of water anyway? Some pony has to be prepared for your nervous breakdowns. <laughs> <laughs> As for Screwball's crush, you shouldn't worry about it. This is a good thing. I love it how Fluttershy is just like thing? the calm and collected good one. Thing? How can it possibly be a good thing? And this thing? like how can it be good the overprotective dad. Is and like Fluttershy like understands. I'm getting to the bottom of this. Discord, wait. Screwball. Who? <laughs> 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 Who is it? Yeah, yeah, calm down. <laughs> calm down now. <laughs> Your mother is under the suspicion that you have a crush. But that's not true, is it? Crush. I mean, you tell us if you had a crush, right? After all, why would you want to keep secrets no? from your old dad? Hmm? Uh, is there a boy? No, no, no. No crush. No, here. totally not. No. <laughs> no, I've just been, I you know, facing out daydreaming over uh, I mean, uh, flowers or. Getting all mushy I don't know. over a boy. <laughs> oh, that. Ah, ah, so you know, who does that, right? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, so no funny. Boo. You know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, boo, boys, you. Icky. Mm. Wow. What do you call her stuff again? Chocolate donuts. They're amazing. Oh. oh. Well, you can eat <laughs> There's whole. still only chocolate sure. donuts in well, this little picture. Taste very good. Chocolate Close seems enough. to be an exception. It tastes like love. Oh. Okay. Your turn to ask a question. I suppose there could be chocolate underneath the Your unicorn, the, the pink the donuts the and the you How know, did that happen? Blue. It runs in our family. She and I were actually born on the same day and we've been best friends ever since. One year we have our birthday party at my house. The next year at Dinky's. Then mine and so on. Oh, that's cool. What's a birthday party? Wow. You really need to get out more. Talk about being a hermit. A birthday party is a party you had to celebrate the day you were born. Oh, in that case, if we had birthday parties back at the hive, we'd have one every day. <laughs> Aunt Pinkie Pie would have a blast. She's the crazy one, right? You bet your tail she is. She may not be my real aunt, <laughs> but she's still my favorite. She can turn any bad day around just by being herself. Plus, she gave me this cool yep. hat. Look at the propeller. She's an inspiration. I love this propeller so much. It's so becoming of me. <laughs> Aww. You have such an amazing family, even though most of them aren't even related to you. I don't get it. Aren't there changelings your age for you to play with? Well, sure, but we don't play, we train. And I usually train alone with Mother. We learn how to hunt so we can feed ourselves. I have to learn especially. Mother says if I'm going to be king, I have to be able to find food for the hive. Does it hurt? You know, when you feed on some ponies' love? Well, when we drain them of their love, we drain them of their power. They slowly weaken, but they're not hurt if we're not around them for long. Maybe we shouldn't be <gasps> so... Look! A shooting star! Hmm. 
Uh, what are you doing? If you make a wish on a shooting star, it'll come true. What did you wish for? Silly. You can't tell your wish, or else it won't come true. They no, uh-uh. to see how a star can yeah. possess magical wish-granting abilities. You're talking to an earth pony with chaotic powers. Furthermore, <laughs> you're a creature that feeds off of water. Yeah, I can do anything. Fair point. Oh, there's another one. This one's yours. Go on, make a wish. But I don't Quick, think... before it burns out. <sighs> I wish I wasn't a changeling so that I could have a heart. Interesting. <laughs> well, the thing is, changelings Next have the hearts. Tiger transformation like, you know. You are too oh, nice. this is an interesting ridge style. <laughs> It might be time for you to like move on to the next level of your training. Yeah, sure, Mother. May I go to bed now? You didn't let me finish. Sorry, Mother. Uh, can you make it quick, though? Why the rush, son? I'm very, very, very sleepy. Oh, uh, good night. Are you really going to bed? Or are you just eager for your rendezvous with I'm your still watching. Just hold on. Friend? Well, what are you talking about, Mother? I'm just really tired, and my hooves are- they feel like they're about to fall off. Which, you know, these holes in my legs aren't exactly making that any better. You can better. cut the charade, son. I know where you've been sneaking off to for the past several weeks. Do you really think anything goes on here without my knowledge? I'm prepared for my punishment, Mother. Punishment? Why in Equestria should I punish you for doing exactly as I told you? Well, I know how much you hate it when other ponies make cracks about our Swiss cheese legs and... What? I asked you to find out whatever you could about the halfling. And you have. You are quite brilliant, my son. That silly filly doesn't suspect a thing. However, your mission will have to be cut short. What do you mean? As I said, you're doing quite well. The next level of your training will require long and tedious hours, so your little scheme will have to be put on hold. Hmm. Interesting. What do you mean by next level of training? The spawn of Discord could be more useful than we thought. She could be the key to our success. Oh, really? And you, my son, oh. will be the one to turn the key in the lock. I don't understand. First lesson in your new level of training, son. Breaking a heart. <laughs> when you go to meet your little girlfriend, you are to inform her that you are unable to see her again. But don't just tell her. Break her. Be cruel. Be cold. Be vicious. You... You want me to... What? Are you deaf, son? Because I've been having to repeat myself over and over. Break the filly's fragile little heart and enjoy the pleasure you'll get from it. But, 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 I don't want to break her heart. What? I, I don't. I, that is, well, she likes me. Of course she does. That was the whole point of the plan. Her feelings should be just high enough for you to crash. But she... she's so much fun. And she's... she's my friend and... Friend! Oh no, I said the F word. Ugh, mothball. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah. Do I have to Come tell on. you? You're not a friend. We cannot yeah. love! I know, but maybe we can... And watch but friendship watch isn't loving. To trouble. Am I right, General? Y yes, my queen. Whatever you may feel towards this filly, your highness, it's best not to pursue it. But if I have no heart, how can I- You don't! And do you know who you have to thank for that? Discord! What? That is why we must have revenge! But you know something? He actually did us a favor. Being heartless has actually helped us. With no love, remorse, nor weakness to hold me back. We changelings can become all we can be. 
and rise above the equid races. Hmm. You wonder why you have no Oh, heart. another song. Why your bodies and Ooh, interesting. Dead. I like this. We don't need those useless parts. Those who I really like the voice actor for Chrysalis. Don't end up well. Love brings you pain. She does it, uh, very nice. Fall in love, you sealed your doom. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> I, I like these, like, slowish, you know, villain songs. They clearly aren't supposed to be very nice sounding. You know? Most villain songs have like a, a minor key to them anyways. This one seems almost like a, a, a waltz. Hearts are made for breaking. Not something hmm. we want in our genes. So, are you saying we weren't always like this? We had hearts once. Discord stole them from us. How? Why? He didn't deem us worthy of love. Neither did the ponies. So, if our hearts were stolen once, we can get them back, right? If you knew what having a heart was like, you wouldn't want it. But maybe I can <laughs> wonder why we're the way we are. Oh, okay, so <laughs> I was just about to say that she was going back to song. So, like, it's creatures like them who'd go clearly. So has to rip she wants him to from our chests. be the ideal prince, you know. Made us like this, so the and I understand that. Decreed. And so it is on their love that we shall feed. Hearts are made for And you know, she of course has a plan. It's best to have none at all. Love is for hmm. the taking. To fall. Endless ceaseless hanging is all it will ever bring. Hearts are made for breaking, not something we want in our king. You have a crown, you have a throne, and a place to call. Oh, interesting. I say interesting, I don't know. Yeah, she wants an ideal person to become, uh, oh, nice. Very nice. Oh, nice. Oh. I really like this song. It, it does the villain motif really well, and it really explains, like, the way that the changelings feel. You know? It's very eerie, very cultish. And I can understand how he must be feeling. Oh, there's two different sides to it. He knows deep down that, like, he's actually feeling something. And man, Chris with his voice actress is doing a really good job at this. This is my favorite song so far in this series. Nice, nice. Oh, that was great. What are you waiting for? And I'm sure he's gonna be like, "What am I gonna say? What am I gonna do?" Oh. 
Magnus. Those you know, two. Mad, she gets what she doesn't get her way. Five thousand three hundred eighty-nine. Five thousand three hundred eighty-nine. No. Oh, there's no five thousand three hundred eighty-ten. She's taking. Start all over. <laughs> She's taking inspiration from Rainbow Ooh. Dash. There you are. What took you so long? I um had trouble sneaking out. Ah, uh, that's okay. You didn't keep me waiting that long. What's with the net? I was thinking we could play some volleyball. Never played it before. Uh. Good. I'll teach you then. Oh yeah. Here, you can serve first. Well, hey, uh, dang. What gives? You think he's gonna do it? He has to. He can't violate a direct order from the queen. He won't. Even if he does, we'll know. Muffy. We can't play volleyball tonight, Screwball. Oh. Okay. His we mother won't let him. Like. How about basketball? No, Screwy. I... <laughs> see it. I... I... I had to stop being friends with you. I can't play with you anymore. What? Why? Yeah. I... I... My mom. I don't want to play with you anymore. You've, you've gotten bored. Or, you know, I don't want to. Yeah. Mazi, what's going <laughs> on? Lying. Why are you lying to me? I, uh, I'm not lying. Yeah, yeah she are. knows. Oh, that's right. She can tell. I mean, I'm not lying. I've grown tired of you. <laughs> it was fun for a while, but then it became dull. And to think I risked getting into trouble for you, you're lucky no one's caught me. Huh? What are you- It really is amazing that I was never caught. I mean, Mother has spies everywhere, and yeah. they don't know a thing about this. Oh! Well, fine! Maybe yes, yes, he's I'm giving tired of you, too. you clues. Is that so? Oh my well, god. <laughs> if we're so tired of each other, then maybe we shouldn't see each other anymore. Fine with me. You know, Good you game. never really were my friend. You're just a stupid, funny eyed girl. Woo! Well, you <laughs> weren't my friend either. I just like disobeying my parents because it's fun to be a disobedient child. After all, how can I be friends yep. with a heartless nice. monster? Oh. <laughs> Okay then, I'll never sneak out to see you <laughs> And those two are like, oh yeah, okay, it's going well. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> You're lying. And I like that little motif playing in the background. Very nice. Whoo-wee, that was a pretty long episode, I gotta say. But, it was good. I really enjoyed it. Um, that might be my favorite episode so far. I'm sorry I didn't have much to say about it. I got a little distracted. But, but I mean, like, it, I don't know. I feel like some of this stuff, I just didn't know what to say. Yeah. It is inspired by, uh, Lion King 2. How awesome. So yeah, uh, that was the third episode of Right of Discord. Er, Daughter of Discord, God. <laughs> I'm getting my series mixed up. But, um, I, I'm sorry guys, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry I'm behind on so many reactions. I hope you guys forgive me, like, uh, I hate this, you know? There are so many things I still want to do and need to do, but I just... Uh, work. Work has been driving me crazy, and now my friends are home for the summer. So my free time is literally almost zero. And I feel bad, because I know there's other, like, blind reactors that are, like... That have, like, more rigorous schedules than I do. I mean, I only work about eight hours a day. Or seven hours a day every day 
you know when I get Thursday and Sunday off and I suppose and I suppose some people have a, a little easier time because maybe they don't have the the greatest social lives or maybe you know we don't have other things to do but I can imagine some of them do have somewhat of a social life and have the other things to do so like I don't think I'm in really a position to to complain or you know be behind but I, I don't know anyways I'm gonna talk about this episode uh, for a little bit yeah I liked how they continued on with the screwball and mothball uh, playing and getting to know each other and I like seeing uh, their relationship bloom. And I also liked how Discord and Fluttershy found out and they were a little eh. Discord was a little more protective and Fluttershy was more understanding. And then, you know, of course, when Chrysalis found out that Mothball had a friend, she was like, no, you, you, you can't, you'll be weak, you know. Friendship could turn into love, and love is something that, you know, Changelings never should do. And so basically she was kind of forcing her way, forcing her wishes onto him, and then the whole high was pitching in. Peer pressure stuff, man. Peer pressure is really tough. Also, sorry about my nose. It's really, it's really stuffed up. But, I... I don't know. I I really liked seeing that stuff get expanded upon, and I felt like this episode was kind of needed. Uh, the stuff of Scooby's friends was probably the worst part of the episode. I'd personally have to say, because I mean that school, you know, that little like playhouse school thing was kind of cute, but I don't know. And I feel like them teasing Screwball a little bit about her crush was alright. But it honestly, you know, none of this episode is really bad or, you know. And I feel like the artwork and the, the music and in terms of the songs really both improved. I feel like ever since uh, Bride of Discord, Disney Fanatic has been getting so much better in finding number one good artists and number two just like presenting the voice actors and just you know layering everything out making a good concise, uh, concise story that really you know works well and flows well together it makes sense um, and you know I have I have somewhat of a uh, bias towards Disney related things. I, I love me some good Disney stuff. Plus the Lion King uh, trilogy. It's one of my all time favorites. Lion King's my favorite Disney movie, so yeah. Um anyways, good episode. I my favorite so far out of the the three, yeah. Definitely my favorite so far. I can't wait to see where they go with this. Like, I wonder if Mothball will, like, betray, you know, the hive. I mean, I'm, in the end, I think him and Screwball are going to get together. You know, at the very end, I think it's probably what they're going to do. I felt like he was going to betray his mother, show him that he's different, and then... You know, Discord and, and Fluttershy will have to accept that he's different also. And they're gonna go with that struggle. But I think the stuff leading to that will be very interesting because there could be some twists and turns that, you know, maybe I don't expect. But, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, I know I certainly did. So, next video I'm probably going to record is uh, the first two episodes of Season 3 of Steven Universe. Whenever I can get those downloaded. 
And, uh, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please be sure to leave a like, comment, and also subscribe if you are interested in my videos. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I will see you guys next time. See ya!